Okay, good morning. I get a lot of queries about butter block sizes. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna make this quite simple. This is a 250 gram block of butter. So it's a quarter of a kilo. So obviously if you scale it up, just I would look at doubling the size. Or if you're gonna use half, half the size. So what I've done is I've prepared a template using some um, thick plastic board and I've cut it to 150 millimeters wide. It's 230 millimeters long. So I plasticize my butter and then I roll it out uh, using my rolling pin. Uh, the thickness of the butter is six millimeters. And what I do is I make the template so that it's this size exactly every time. Um, the measurement is, works very well. The butter, because it's not so thick, um, will come back up to room temperature quite quickly. In fact, if you just roll it with your rolling pin, holding it in the plastic to maintain the shape, and you just roll it a few times um, before you put it into the dough, uh, the butter will become flexible, but this is the uh, this is the best size that I found uh, for use with the 250 gram butter block. So I hope this helps. Uh, it's very easy to make if you just get some uh, plastic curry, curry board, I believe it's called, and you cut it out of this dimension. You can keep this in your workplace and you can have it as a template so that your butter block is the same size uh, every time that you make it. I hope you enjoyed this quick video and happy baking.